You're watching Good Morning Maryland. There's a new poll out focused on how much inflation is impacting you. I'm Erin McPherson and this is your WMAR 2 News update. According to the latest Goucher College poll, 56% of Marylanders say recent price increases have caused either a minor or major financial hardship. 43% say they haven't felt an impact at all. About half of Marylanders have a positive view of Maryland's economy, 41% a negative view. When those surveyed were asked to compare their current financial situation to last year, 47% said it's about the same, 33% say it's worse, while 19% say it's better. We have that full poll on WMAR2news.com. Well, it was a violent weekend in Baltimore. At least 10 people were shot, four of them killed. Just after one in the morning on Saturday, a man was shot and killed on Stiles Street in the city's Little Italy neighborhood. And in northwest Baltimore, four people were shot at the intersection of Liberty Heights and Gwyn Oak Avenue. Three men in their mid-20s were killed. A 73-year-old man survived. So far, no arrests in these shootings. There have now been 65 murders so far this year in 2022. Well, today, students and staff at Baltimore City Public Schools are no longer required to, to wear a mask in school. The city school system is the last school district in our area to make face coverings optional. Masks are still required to be worn for 10 days if a person has close contact with someone who has COVID, is recovering from COVID after isolating, or develops COVID-like symptoms at school. And now from WMAR 2 News, Maryland's most accurate forecast. Happy Monday, Maryland. Get outside today and soak up some of that sunshine. We have a lot of it that will take us through the afternoon. So with the sunshine and the winds mainly out of the south southwest around 8 to 16 miles per hour, that's going to help our temperatures climb well above normal upper 50s and the lower 60s today and looking to stay above normal only dropping off into the upper 30s and the lower 40s as we head overnight. So a sunny and and a pleasant day on tap today. Temperatures will really start to warm as we head into the next couple of days. 67 for your Tuesday with mostly sunny skies and keeping skies rather sunny and conditions quite beautiful for the middle of the work week. There is a chance of a few showers for St. Patrick's Day, milder with highs in the 70s to wrap up the work week. Thanks, Stevie. We'll stay with us at WMAR2news.com for updates to stories throughout the day. And for news and weather while you're on the go, download the WMAR2news app in the App Store. Thanks for watching. I'm Erin McPherson.